scale, impact, and integration. Transactions are not inclusive. We need open spaces so students engage each other. We also need to rethink our impact. We can't just scale, we have to scale with equity. And these transformative experiences must be integrative. If not, we are not scaling our reach. Aren't we all connected? What role does privilege play when it comes to career services? Why are the rules different for different people? How can we embrace this with more dignity? Access to resources for some, but not for others? The unwritten rules, the formal rules, the invisible bars. Here's the thing, the structures change when spaces and context changes. What is in one place is not in the other. These so-called norms change when people change. Success is piloted by people. Everyone is not equal in privilege. It affects people differently. So when that context changes, what happens? How we feel relates to how we perceive. When facing the loss of privilege, we finally realize that it was there. Why are we conditioned to see that unequal privilege is normal when it's not? As staff, we need to re-examine ourselves and interrogate our policies and procedures. And for some, to stop deflecting and denying that privilege exists. I like to call it the art of evading accountability.